Hey, it's Kevin and Puffy. They have a new roommate in LA. Do you like it, Puff? He loves it. Um, and I love it too. Seriously, I am so happy to be living here. And today I wanted to film a little day in my life to show you what I've been up to throughout the day. Because someone commented recently asking what I do throughout the day. So this is for you. You're welcome. Before we get into it though, thank you to my friends over at Skillshare for sponsoring this video and giving me this video idea. It's inspired by Skillshare. And if you couldn't tell, maybe you couldn't, but I'm filming on my iPhone right now, which I never do. I usually film with my DSLR camera, but today we're switching it up because I just learned how to film better on my iPhone. So I'm gonna just film this entire video on an iPhone, my iPhone 11. And I wanted to do this to show you that you can make YouTube videos without fancy equipment. So if you didn't know, Skillshare is an online learning community for creatives like myself and maybe you. And it's a place where you can learn and take the next step in your creative journey and figure out how to do things um, involving photography, video making, making, editing, the list goes on and on. I took a class on iPhone filmmaking, which is taught by Caleb Badcock and Niles Gray. And I learned from watching their videos how to film more stably. And I really like how Skillshare just wants you to learn, meaning there's no ads and it's really cheap too. It's less than $10 a month for an annual subscription. And the first thousand of my subscribers to click the link in my description will get a free trial of the premium membership. Okay, I know it might make me look like a doofus, but safety first, I don't feel like getting injured. Mask is on and we're ready to bike to the beach. Hey, okay, I'm taking off my mask because there's no one around. But as you just saw, the beach is foggy, misty, whatever you want to call it. I'm not a weatherman. I hope that it clears up a bit for me to surf later. We shall see. But it's been a really good morning so far and I'm glad you got to see my bike route. I'm gonna start to head back. So I will see you when I'm back at my apartment. Okay, now I'm gonna go on the clock. Um, before I go on the clock, I just wanted to address the question everyone's been asking me on here is, how do you make money to live in LA? You don't have a job, what's up? Like, how, how are you doing that? I'm gonna answer that for you. Because even family members don't understand how I could just live out here <laughs> without a normal job. But I am actually like working, I'm gonna probably be on my computer for the next two hours after I'm done talking to you. But basically, I am just continuing my influencer lifestyle that I've been living for the past like five years now. I've been making money through doing content creation for different brands since I was in high school. And I'm now a year out of college. Like, it's kind of old news. Right now, I'm part of four different campaigns. So I have to create content for four different companies and a lot goes into it. Some days I won't have much to do, some days I will have a lot to do. Like today, I don't have that much to do, which is why I went on a bike ride, and it's just a really flexible job. Even though I don't really consider it a job because I just enjoy it so much. And I also am my grandma's manager. So as you know, my grandma is TikTok famous, and she needs help managing and you know running her campaigns because a lot of companies reach out to her. So all of that goes through me, which is another job within itself because a lot, a lot goes into that too. Maybe if you're interested, I'll make a video on that. But yes, I get some money from that. My grandma also gets dough from that. I'm not just pocketing everything. Um, we have that all figured out, so don't you worry. So I'm glad we're all on the same page now on how I make money. <laughs> I don't know why it's such a hot topic, but I appreciate the concern and now, now you know. And I also just wanted to say, I have been making my own money for, like I said, a while now, and I'm not just saying this to brag, I'm saying that you could do it too if you put your mind to it and trust the, what you're doing, because if you really wanna make money doing something that you love, you really could, and I have a lot of faith that you could do the same, whatever it may be. And I just like being on my own schedule, but I do want to use my degree this year. I'm gonna try to get a job at some point, I am just putting the job search on hold right now because 
like I said, I'm pretty comfy right now. And also no one helps me. Like I pay for everything on my own. I'm not like a trust fund kid. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to get a job at some point that I can go to. I also recognize how I am very fortunate to be able to do what I do and I'm so appreciative. Like you have no idea every day I wake up so thankful. I kind of want to do my own thing for as long as I can before I succumb to corporate America because I heard it's not too fun. So I'm just gonna continue to, you know, create some content for different brands and sell my soul. Um, no, I really, I, trust me, I really only work with brands that I really believe are good and you could actually benefit from. Like today, Skillshare, I actually think you could like, genuinely benefit from using their service. I'm not gonna be fake. I know I just moved to LA, but I won't be fake and give you brands that I don't think are good, okay? That's not me, and I appreciate you for watching me and allowing me to live this lifestyle because without you, like, I wouldn't be able to. So, thank you. Now that we've had that overdue conversation, I'm gonna be productive, and I will talk to you when I'm at the beach, about to surf. Okay, so we just made it to the beach, and I'm about to surf for the very first time. I know nothing but we're gonna give it a go. I have my wetsuit. How are you feeling? I'm feeling very nervous, but I have surfed one time before, so at least I have some background knowledge and I'm sure it'll be great. <laughs> I can't believe this. I can't either. <laughs> Just watched the sunset on my roof and as always just a very colorful one i don't know what it is in california the sunsets just are just very different and every day they just come to play and they're just ready to give you a show um, if you follow me on instagram you know what i'm talking about i post one like every day and my new year's resolution this year was actually not to miss a single sunset and another one that i just made for myself is to become a really good surfer and i'm not going to stop until i get really good this wasn't captured today, but I actually got up and stood on the surfboard and rode it all the way into the beach. I know there's no proof of that, but you just gotta trust me and I will hopefully get that on camera one day for you so you know that I'm not just pulling your leg. Usually I just go to the beach and sit there, but now I have an activity to do and work on and get really good at and I just, I can't wait to just get really good and you can quote me on that. I'm gonna be a actual surfer. Like I'm starting out and I just have so much ambition to just keep going. Now I'm gonna take a shower because there's sand everywhere. And like if I go like this, sand just like falls from my hair. But yeah, I'll talk to you later. Now it's time for bed. I'm all tucked in. And I just wanted to say thanks for watching my day in the life of just living in LA as a new resident and filming this entire video on my iPhone. So I hope this shows you that you don't need fancy equipment to be a YouTuber. You could just do it off of your phone. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. I also want to just be real with you for a second and let you know that I don't have amazing days like this every single day. Like I had a really good day today and I found myself just so appreciative and just looking around being like, wow, like I can't believe I live here but there are days that I just wake up feeling off. So I just want you to know that not every day is amazing, but today was a great day and I loved it. And I know tomorrow's gonna be a great day too. Good night.